and welcome to Ben's Minute number 101. And today I'm looking at my uh, at the YouTube feed and everything, and it looks like Dylan got the book because he's the only person who commented. So congratulations, Dylan, you get the book. And today's topic is actually going to be on little reality and big reality. And what I mean by these, these are kind of different realities we each of us live in. And what the funny thing is, the little reality always trumps the big reality. Now, let me explain what the realities are. Now, little reality is like something that you've been brought up to believe or what you think about yourself. And a big reality is actually who you are. You know, a lot of people will say like, uh, you're, he's a great baseball player or she's a great tennis player or whatever. I'll put sports analogies a little bit easier. And, and so... But when, when when they play, they might they might think of a little R, a little reality, like for themselves. They might consider, you know what, I'm not as good as this, or I'm really good at that, but I'm not as good as that, you know. And those are the kind of feelings your conscience or whatever 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 you have up there that kind of tells you you're good and you're not good at certain things. Now it's always always a great exercise to step out and remember what the big I call it the big R and the little R. What, what the big R really, really is, to really kind of find out who you really are out on the outside, rather than what you're feeling on the inside. Now, this is a huge topic, and I really want to get into a lot of it, but I will, I will, I will probably probably discuss a little bit more of it tomorrow. But if you guys have any questions, obviously comment, like, subscribe, blah, 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 blah. and I hope you stay mindful. I hope you stay motivated. I hope you have a great night.